It's a custom design that we've really stepped through with a client. This is a Villa 26 footer, which is really that modern farmhouse chic feeling. There's a lot in the pot, but it's, it's definitely design focused. This 26 footer has allowed us to create some different spaces that we're really excited about. Yeah, you step right in from the front door and your kitchen's right there. There's a table that drops down. So there's nice seating that we can stow away later. We also have a unique feature with this countertop. It can pivot and create a little bit more counter space. It's a nice compact kitchen but everything is there. So we have our cooktop. Of course, we have a hood that will vent to the outside. Sink's a nice farmhouse style sink. It's a porcelain sink. We have our fridge. You can see the washer dryer there that both washes and dries. We try to balance the, the space that we have. So all these ideas and just our workflow that you're in a kitchen, we really pay attention to. lots of windows and the sizes are bigger. The bedroom, for example, those windows are more important to kind of bring that outside in so you're not in a little box but you can enjoy the outside. That's our key with this design is large enough windows that it doesn't feel claustrophobic. You can really have a nice vista as you sit down. bedroom is downstairs. We keep it all on one level, which is really helps with just kind of your daily back and forth. So there's storage underneath the bed. You can lift it up. We call it a hydraulic lift bed. So it has hydraulic kind of hinges. It's like the back of a canopy in a truck where it doesn't allow it to slam down. It'll keep it up in an upright position when it's up. And then as it drops down, you don't have to remake the bed. So that's a nice part of this design. Just that, trying to get as much storage into these tiny houses as we can, and that's one of the, our solutions. If you need a little extra space, we do offer this loft, and you move the little ladder, and it's up and over. You can imagine extra clothes, extra storage space. So the toilet is a new thing for us. This one is unique where everything burns. This is an electric-based incinerating toilet. You plug it in and it all goes up the flue. Very nice shower. Yeah, so it's a three foot shower. It's a tile shower. It's, um, you know, glass door. All those things are really important. So the sink is compact. It's a balance of space. Some people really want more living room space, less bathroom space. With that, you get a little smaller sink, but still very functional. So my favorite parts, I mean, I love how open it is. I love the vault in the main space. The kitchen is a really nice, tight kitchen. A lot of times we build a very large kitchen and so this is a little toned down kitchen but it really frees up a lot of other space for the tiny house. I really like how efficient it is. We have the mini split heat pump in there and we also have this unique thing that's specific to this client is they wanted wool insulation. So there's wool insulation in the walls and the ceiling. It has the same R value as our fiberglass option but it has a little bit more of an environmental feel to it. Oh, it's great to get one out. It's wonderful to see it out of the shop. We're gonna definitely have a happy customer after this one.